Do you ever have those days where it's completely head empty, no thoughts? Like, literally. My mind is blank right now. Like, I I'm putting this recording on and I want to talk, but I don't know what to talk about. So, I don't know. I don't is it like an ADHD thing? Because I have all these like noises like incoherent noises that are in my head but then like when I try to conjure up like a coherent thought it's just not happening for me like there's like buzz it's like a bunch of bees kind of in your head I don't know it's weird I should probably look into this but yeah um I have a blanket with me because it's actually quite chilly today it's not as bad as it was yesterday. Yesterday was cold. I mean, it's not that cold. It's like 10 degrees, which in Taiwan is cold, especially with the humidity. Like, it feels a lot colder than it actually is. My hands are like ice cold. Um, but yeah, I have a blanket for extra cozy vibes. I had, one of my goals for the new year was to have, basically do less impulse shopping. And that lasted approximately a week and the reason that i got this was because i was watching hawkeye and not to spoil anything basically there's this one scene where kate bishop uses a label maker and that scene is approximate like what three seconds maybe 10 seconds long and i saw that scene and i wanted a label maker and i held out for about five days and then i didn't help hold out anymore so we have this. I've been labeling so many things already and it's the funnest thing. Um, and it's very, very satisfying. So I don't know. I don't think I should continue trying to talk because I really don't know what I want to talk about. Hmm. So yeah, let's, uh, I'm going to record stuff and <laughs> you're going to come along because I am having a head empty day.
doing a tally of what I need to get from the stationery store. Um, I need to get a refill for this erasure thing. Basically allows me to erase on smaller areas. So they sell refills for this. I need to get that. And then I want to pick up a new one of this bullet point eraser. Just because the grip here is like super grubby. Um, and I've tried wrapping tape around it, but it doesn't work. So I'm going to get a new one of these. And then I think that's it. We also need to get blue tack. Let's see, hold on. So I've been taping up my art prints on my wall. But with washi tape. But I want to get blue tack so like the corners don't stick up. Yeah, we're going to... I'm gonna go to the stationery store and uh, do a couple of other life errands. Maybe get boba on the way back because I don't, know, I don't know if you can tell, but it's a nice day outside today, which is really nice. And yes, I do have a yellow monstera leaf here um, because I really like the color of it. And why not? So it's gonna be stay here until it's like fully browned, and then I'm probably gonna check it out afterwards. But yeah. So that's it. Uh, that's what we're gonna do. And let's go.
Um, I thought I would film from a different angle this time, just because it's not, it's like dark outside, so we don't have the reflection lighting thing. Anyways, I'm actually sitting on the handle of my chair just because I would not be tall enough. But anyways, um, I realized it's 24th of January today and I realized that I need to get all the mail out by at least Wednesday for it to have a chance to kind of leave the country before uh, Lunar New Year kicks in, which is on, on Saturday, I think. Um, so I've been spending all day kind of doing the final botanical study for Patreon um, and also writing uh, the January letter that I also include. Um, it was actually surprisingly tough to write just because I think January for me has kind of been just making it day by day and I guess I wanted to start off January more hopeful and excited and the first couple of attempts that I did to write that letter was trying to convey that but I wasn't able to write that because I wasn't feeling that way um and yeah and then the last version was kind of just me being truthful and honest and basically talking about just sometimes it's okay to make it day by day which is not not like a great start to like the new year I guess traditionally speaking but it is an honest way um so yeah we're gonna print those out oh different angle hold on let me adjust this so oh that's a bit awkward yeah so my camera battery died. I'm using my phone to record this. Because you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, but yeah, um, I have the paper cut beforehand, which I think will just make it easier for the process. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna print and maybe spend the evening working because I have to go back to the day job tomorrow. Uh, maybe spend the evening working and hopefully be able to get everything out stamped in the mail uh, by Tuesday. Nope, Tuesday's tomorrow. Wednesday. By Wednesday. Because everything else is already packed and in the envelopes. So you need to print out the letters, stamp the names, stamp the envelopes, and then in they go. But yeah. January has been great for art. I've done a lot of sketching. I'm preparing a sketchbook dump for the patrons. And that includes like, what, 10 at least 10 spreads which is like 20 pages which is a lot like i created a lot of work um and i've shit there's a thing i should have drawn but i will draw it it's fine um but yeah i've created a lot of art in january and that was good um i've also learned to kind of stand up for myself and kind of be more realistic of what i can do and can't do um, but also not being scared or less scared. I, I don't think I'm not scared. I'm just less scared of like trying new things and, and, you know, accepting that not everything will work out. Um, but yeah, I don't really know where I'm going with this.
家再加入了的话。嗯嗯嗯嗯嗯嗯嗯嗯嗯